Well, WVUA is in Montgomery today where elected leaders are wrapping up the final day of the 2012 regular legislative session. Still on this final day, there is a lot of work to be done, including approval of the education and general budgets and Alabama's immigration law. WVUA's Daniel Sparkman is in Montgomery and he joins us live with the latest. Daniel. Now, Terry, one of the big topics of today, this the final day of the 2012 regular legislative session is, of course, the state's general fund and education trust fund budgets. Now, a conference committee is meeting right now made up of members of both houses, the Senate and the House of Representatives, trying to come up with some sort of deal on both budgets before tonight's midnight deadline, which is the official end to this year's legislative session. Now, the House Ways and Means Committee Chairman Jim Barton said the main difference is how to deal with a $184 million funding hole. In the House version of the shortage is in Medicaid and in the Senate it's in prison funding. The legislators may actually let voters decide on how to fill that funding gap coming up in the November elections. Senator Bobby Singleton spoke with him earlier and he says that this slower process getting through the budget is actually going to help us come out with a better budget overall. What we've been trying to do is look at numbers. We look at our actuaries around the state in terms of money that is coming in through taxes, uh, trying to find out where money would be in 13 in terms of our growth. So all of that kind of holds up uh, the budgets and to make sure that we're getting the best budget out that we possibly can. Uh, there have been a lot of amendments and other solutions being offered. And the more you go through it, the slower the process is, the more you can get more input on. So that's why the budgets are being held up at this point. Now, once the conference committee meeting is over, both houses will still have to vote on the resolution that came out of that meeting. But coming up tonight at 6, we have another big topic, which has been immigration all through the regular session. Some more decisions made today. Both houses took up a bill to clarify some of the language in the law. And we'll hear from both sides of that topic coming up tonight on WVA News at 6. Reporting live at the Alabama State House in Montgomery, Daniel Sparkman, WVA News.